Hi, in this video I'm going to explain how to configure and use the data fetch script, which will automatically collect activity raw data for you, whether they were generated by Trakinetics Monitor or by Pizzolo Video. The script will transfer the data to a location where they can be accessed by Pizzolo when it's time to do the analysis, storing them in an ordered fashion. It will also make a backup of the data for safety purposes and can optionally communicate with you via email to alert you if something is wrong with data collection. To configure the data fetch script, you need to edit a few variables in the configuration file. Navigate to the configuration file that in Linux is found here in the accessory subfolder of the Pizzolo directory and open the configuration file using your favorite text editor. As you can see here, the configuration file is open as read-only by default. Therefore, before editing, you need to save the file on your home folder. It is important that you save it in your home folder, otherwise it will not be properly read by the script. Now that the file is editable, change the value of these first five lines. Everything else is optional. The first thing you need to tell the programs is how many and which monitors you have. Let's say you have four monitors, number one to four, you will write one, dash 4 here. Here you have to specify at what time your Zeitgeber 0 starts. Our incubator has the lights on at 10.30 in the morning, so here we write 10.30. After setting the time, you now need to specify the path to the folders where all the raw data are located, where the daily data are saved, and where the backup data will be stored. It is wise to put the backup folder somewhere on an external hard drive, or even better, on a disk connected through the network. However, in this example, we'll just put it on the desktop along with the others. This remaining part is mainly to be used if you are collecting data using the infrared beam split system. This last part is to be configured if you want the script to communicate with you via email. It's quite self-explanatory, so I will not go into details. Now, save the edited file, and what happens now is that every time this script here is executed, daily data will be collected from the raw data folder and processed to be handled by Pizzolo. You could either do this manually, or you can configure the system to do this automatically for you every day. The easiest way to proceed is to install from the Ubuntu Software Center a little software called Schedule Task. Once Schedule Task is installed, launch it from the Start menu here. Now, tell the program you want to run a recurrent Schedule Task. Give your task a verbose description, for instance, Pizzolo Daily Data Fetching. And now here you need to specify the location of the script, which in Ubuntu will be the following. Almost done. The last thing you need to do is to set execution time shortly after the beginning of light on, so the data from the previous day will be collected few minutes after the day has ended. Now click on Add to add the task, OK, and you're done.